the 4th of July. I'm gonna go to the gym because nobody will be there. You're probably wrong because that's what I thought. And there were so many people there. It's like, what the hell are y'all doing here? Go do 4th of July things. I can't because I work later. But the rest of you get out. <laughs> Also, I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna take a shower, and I'm gonna try, my, try to take my eyelashes off without ripping my eyelashes out. So I'll film that. We'll see if it works. <laughs> Hopefully it works, cause they're driving me crazy. And even if I did wanna get them done again, which if it wasn't so expensive, sure. Um, the girl that I went to is literally booked out until like the first week of August. So, I'm not gonna be looking like an idiot this whole time. Not super stoked about the last time I got them done. I loved how they looked the first week, but we are now on the second week and they're just falling out all over the place. They look dumb, they look clumpy. They're like going whatever way they want. It's really hot though. It was really hot in the gym. So I don't I don't really know why. Because normally it's cold, but it was hot. I know this is all information you wanted. You're welcome. Okay, so I know I said I was gonna shower first, but I'm not going to. I just want to have my coconut oil. <laughs> I just want to see if this is gonna work. I don't have super high hopes that will, to be honest. I don't know how to set you up. Let me, since this case does not do well with tripods. Here, how about a nice towel? Please don't fall over. Thank you. Okay, first off, taking contacts out, because I don't really want coconut oil all over my contacts. For hopefully obvious reasons. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna be really sad. Also, probably because I'll just look stupider. I mean, they don't look super awful. They just, I'm just over it, you know? Okay. Coconut oil. You must liquefy the coconut oil. <laughs> So I did one Google search of how to safely remove eyelash extensions and it just said coconut oil. So that's what I'm going off of. Oh, I'm scared though. I'm scared, what if it doesn't work? I'm just gonna end up pulling all my lashes out actually. I don't know how to do this. What am I doing? <laughs> Maybe I should put it on a little brushy. Maybe I need more. Need more, and then I'm gonna put down a little brushy thing, and then maybe when I brush my lashes, they'll fall off. I don't know. Am I supposed to just put them on my eyeballs? Like that? Ew, I feel so gross. Ewy. It's very oily. Duh, but like, okay. Ow. I'm trying to look in a mirror so I can like kind of see what I'm doing. I need a better case that works with the tripod because this is a little ridiculous right now. Okay. I don't know exactly. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just say it as it freaking is. I don't know what I'm doing. So far, nothing's happening though. <laughs> you get it all over the brushy. Get it all over the brush. <laughs> oh, there's fur on the brush now. Okay, that's fine. Um, so it just feels like I'm brushing them out now. It doesn't feel like anything's happening. Now my hand is covered in oil. Okay, pause. Let me, okay. I don't. Nothing appears 
to be happening at all. Fuck. Well, I don't know what else to do about this. I don't want to deal with trying to get them removed by the girl because she's booked out until like fucking August and these just don't look that great. Watch, all of them on my left side are going to come out and then none of the right ones will. <laughs> that would suck. Um, hello? Maybe I should try makeup remover? Ow, I stabbed myself in the eyeball. They're like not even budging. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> this isn't working. Maybe I need to be a little more aggressive, huh? Be more aggressive. Be aggressive. Be e aggressive. B E A G E R S S S S B. I don't know how to spell aggressive. Fuck. Get off of my eyeball. Owie. Nothing is happening except now I just have a bunch of coconut oil in my eyes. Dang it. Okay, I'm gonna put you back down. Now my eyes just feel funny. Maybe I should try a makeup remover. Oh god. I should just try tugging on them a little bit. Slight tugs. Nothing's happening. Ow. Except it kind of hurts a little bit. Okay, well, that didn't work. And now I can't see, and oh hey, I got one! Yay! <laughs> Ow! Ow! Let's try some makeup remover, huh? Maybe I just need to let it sit for a second. I don't know. I don't know, but. Ow! Okay, bad idea. See, because the goal is to remove them without losing like all of my lashes, you know? <gasps> this is working! Oh, yes! I really hope I still have lashes after this though, because if I don't, I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, it stopped working. It was working for like two seconds. It's fine. Okay guys, we can do this. It's it's fine. We got this. I can't see anything. <laughs> I'm like half blind. Okay, this does seem to be working a little bit. Maybe I'll just like end up getting enough off that they're at least more even so the left side doesn't look as ridiculous. Ow. But then they'll both just look ridiculous, so. I've really started something that I shouldn't have in doing this because of obvious reasons. Because like if I get some off but I don't get them all off. Ow, 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 it hurts my eyeball. Oh, well, they're all stuck to my eyeball, that's why. That's why it hurts, but look at how good it's working. Can you see anything? I can't tell because I can't see anything. So, it's not very focused. That's more focused. So they're kind of coming out. I don't know if that's because I'm being slightly more aggressive now or not, but fur all over this brush. There's fur all over my life though. Oh my, oh my kitty. My life is just covered with fur. Ow, okay. <gasps> Ow. Well. So I got them almost all off on my left side, like I thought would happen. And the right side is really just hanging in there. Also like I thought would happen, so. 
Is this a cute look? <laughs> Maybe like an actual brushy brush, you know? Like one of these, one of these brushy brushes. So kind of help. Come on. Dude, the right side is on there. That's really obnoxious because the left side's already almost fully out. <laughs> Scratch my eye again. The left side's almost fully off. Do I have any lashes left? I really fucking hope so. If not, oh well, I guess. Life goes on, you know. I'll just look like an idiot for a little bit, but. I'd rather look like an idiot with like very thin lashes than an idiot with like really bad fake lashes, you know? We've all seen that girl with fake lashes and it just looks not good at all. I think I still have some lashes under there. That's exciting. I don't know if I'll have any on the right side, but on the left side at least, they're kind of starting to come off. Okay, well this is very difficult to do with one hand. Um, I'll check back in with you guys in a second and hopefully I'll be bald. Feel like an infant. <laughs> I feel like a newborn baby. <laughs> but it did take another 20 minutes, but I finally got them off. Obviously, I still have some lashes. I'll put some mascara on before I go to work. But I kind of miss them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Well, I took a nap and then I woke up and I put some mascara on and I still look like a newborn fetus. <laughs> um, so that's exciting. I don't know how much of it's just because I'm not used to that anymore. I feel like a lot of it's because my lashes just got fucked. <laughs> so that's a good time. Oddly enough, though, I don't absolutely hate how I look with, like, no lashes. Definitely prefer the lashes, but they're too expensive, too time-consuming, too obnoxious. So, there's that. I'm going to get ready for work now. It's 3 p.m. Oh my gosh, you guys, it was the shock of a century. It wasn't busy my headlights out. Well, hopefully I don't get pulled over in my way home. <laughs> we had a total of, I would say, three, no, two little me mini baby, barely anything at all rushes. Like three people came in at the same time for like both of those, I think. And that was it. One of them happened at like eight, and the other one happened, oop, scratch my car. And the other one happened at like, nine forty-five or something, I don't know. But it was dead. <laughs> so you know what that means, I get to go home early. <laughs> Because even, so from, I got there at 4, right? Dead from 4 to like 8. We were sitting there at 7.45 and the doctor on shift was like, um, how long are you here till? And I said, well, midnight. And he said, you know, I don't really know why you're here. And I was like, I don't either. Apparently after Memorial Day, the swing ER wanted a swing CCR, so I'm here. And he said, well, we really appreciate it, but I don't know. I feel like we need to like switch our scheduling around or something. If I just drive with my brights on, do you think that's better than like one headlight out? I don't know. <laughs> and so I was like, no, it's, it's cool, it's fine, like whatever. 
and he was like, okay, well, I mean, we have more people getting here at 10 and then closer to midnight, so we'll see. And I was like, okay. And so we had our little, you know, our little uh, rush. And I was like, see, it is a good thing that I'm here. Like, okay, cool. I put two people in rooms. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> um, but, and then nothing was happening again. And then we had another tiny little baby rush and then nothing was happening for like a long time and I was just standing there. And one of the girls I work with goes, do you want to go home? <laughs> I was like, yes, please. Cause they all know that I'm not, I'm not used to that schedule at all. So I feel awake because you know, I don't have a choice but to be awake, but I'm so tired and my head hurts kind of a lot. And so <laughs> she, she was like, okay, let me, let me ask the new doctor that was on staff. She was like, do you care if Devin leaves? And she was like, no, get out of here. And I was like, thank you so much. <laughs> Why is there a Tesla parked literally in a field? I don't know. Welcome to Reno on 4th of July. <laughs> so, I'm on the freeway. I'm gonna pay attention because there are drunk drivers out. Actually, there was a guy that was getting a sobriety test um, in front of my job earlier today. So, <laughs> that was fun to watch. Also, so many drug people called us. And you know, you can just tell that they're plastered, but they're trying to not sound plastered. And I was like, holy hell, you people. <laughs> uh, but anyway, it is 11.25. <laughs> so I gotta go home like 45 minutes early. Not just like a little early, 45 minutes early. I'm stoked. Yeah, my paycheck is gonna really suck next week because I worked like a day and like seven and a half hours this week. So it's gonna be a sad paycheck, but you know what? I'm cool with it. <laughs> uh, yay, okay, anyway, I'm going to go home. I might as well just upload this while I'm awake right now because I'm pretty decently awake. Um, it's really dark. I should probably just like stop recording, huh? I probably should. Anyway, I don't know. I'll see how I feel. I kind of feel like I deserve a treat. Um, because I didn't screw anything up. People on Swing Shift were actually really helpful. Um, and it really was not bad at all. I feel really bad for day shift, sorry Lauren, because I know day shift was absolutely nuts. I feel like it's so hit or miss that it's like, I don't know, there's really no way around that kind of situation. Either you're gonna be overstaffed and risk if you send people home early, you're gonna get screwed or you're gonna be understaffed, but we don't have enough CCRs to have like double during the day and one it swing, so I don't know. I feel bad for day shift because swing was easy. So there's that. Wow, I'm really excited to sleep. Even though I did take like a solid hour and a half long nap today. My head hurts and I'm tired. Maybe I'll just wait until tomorrow to do this. I don't know, I haven't decided yet. Either way, I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.